Okay, what we're going to do now is see how quickly we can create a complete mobile website, have it live on the web and actually displaying on a mobile phone. So let me just bring up a, a timer here. So you can see we're, we're starting at zero. So what I'm going to do now is I haven't got any website at all here. And I'm going to just start the timer and I'm going to go through the process of creating a, a small website. It's not going to be very complicated, just a fairly small website, but it's going to have the basics of what you need for almost every website included in it. We're going to include a map. Um, we're going to have a menu with some different pages and a, a contact us form and so on like that. So let's just go here and let's click start. And we go to add new pages. And we're going to create a page for the wellness clinic. I'm going to call it. So let's call it wellness clinic. Clinic. Um, let's just say um, we have been providing massage treatment for over 17 years. That will do. That's just something to get us started. Um, let's come down and what we're going to do, we put the name of the site in here, Wellness Clinic. And that's a site. It's going to be a black on grey theme. That's fine, yes. I want a logo. Let me upload a logo here. So I get a logo from my computer. So I select files. And I want this file here. It loads it for me. There's my image down there. And all I have to do is come here and do insert into post. And that's included for me. Um, if I want, let's have a top navigation bar included on this page as well. Uh, that's it. Let's just save our information there now. And that should have us our first page already started. And how are we doing for time? We're at 1 minute and 41 seconds. So let's come down and just preview it on our preview. And there we have the start of our first page. Okay, now let's add a, a menu to this. Well, maybe what we'll do before we do that, I know it's taking time, but let's just make that um, bold and centered, and we'll update that so when we come in next time it looks a little bit neater. Um, let's add a new page. What we're going to do, we're going to put here um, our services. So. I'm going to use that same name for my page title, so let's just copy that and paste it into here. Um, I can put a little icon, what we have there. Um, let's have a, let's put a baby there, just something, a person, okay. Um, let's say that we're going to do um, Zen stone massage. Now, this is where heated uh, stones are used in combination with a specialized, I can't spell, combination with a specialized Massage. Now I could continue writing, but I'm just going to just leave it at that for the moment. Now I'm going to tell it that my parent for that is the wellness clinic, and this is number one, so this is going to be the first thing in my menu. Um, what else do I need to tell it here? I've done all that. We've given it a little logo there. Um, we want the logo to appear on the top. Yes, uh, that's it pretty much. We don't want anything more on there. Let's publish that. So we've got an our services page. So let's go back to our mobile sites here. And the wellness clinic view the site pages. And you'll see now we've got wellness clinic and our services. Let's add another one. Let's, for example, um, add a reservations page. So let's put in here 
reservations um, to make a reservation for a massage please click the call button below so just going to put just that let's fix that up click um we're going to do there we want to um let's just stick a badge on that for a no let's put a um a telephone Where's my phone? Phone, phone. There we go. Let's have a telephone there. Okay, that's that one done. Now we see it's a parent as well as clinic again. And this one is the second one in our list. So publish that. If I now go back to our site. We've now got Wellness Clinic, our services and reservations. Let's add another um, page. Let's, for example, um, add our location. So I'm going to put that in down here as well. Uh, for that. And let's find a little map. Where's my map? Uh, no, I've got a sign, haven't I? It's, uh, signpost, let's put a signpost there uh, for that one, so that's that we've got the logo at the top of the page again um, and here we're just going to type in we are located at 5 Wall Street Manhattan in the heart of the financial District. Okay, my spelling's not so good. Can't spell Manhattan there, so that's that. Now, what I'm also going to do here, um, I'm going to add a map. So, what I'm going to go, go and do now is come down here to where my map settings are. I'm going to type in my address, 5, I've already done it one time, 5 Wall Street. Um, my zoom is 14, and I want map directions. I want to say your location and the button text is get directions. Okay, that's done. Now I say that the parent of this is the wellness clinic and this is going to be number three on my list. Okay, let's just publish that so we can see what happens here. So now I've got my post created with that. Now to get my map on there, all I do, I come back down here to the map settings. I want the map that's from the address that's on this page here. So I highlight that and copy it. And I just come back up here into my editing area and paste that here. And save it again. And we should now find that if we go to our preview at the bottom of the page, That we have directions and a map and it shows us exactly where we are 5 Wall Street Manhattan in New York okay so if we now go back to our current site and look at all the pages we've got we've got the wellness clinic our services reservations our location um, and if we just go back to the main site itself Then we come down to our preview here, and you can see, ah, I forgot to put the title in the reservations there. I'll go and fix that in one moment. But you see we've got our services. This will say reservations in one moment. This is our location. We'll put our little bit of text there to say we've been providing massage services for over 17 years. And at the moment, it took us a total of eight minutes to do all of this work. Now, if we come down here, and we just click on this. Wait one moment while I while we get the camera organised here for us. And what we do, hopefully, we'll be able to get the camera showing the uh, 
two R code being read there. So if I just put the iPhone in front and read the QR code and show, show you, and it will now go direct to the website we've just created. Okay. So now there's our website. It even has the missing word that you saw. So if I click our location. And now if I type in our location, 123 Wall Street, uh, Park Avenue, sorry, I want to put in Park Avenue, 123 Park Avenue. And Manhattan. and get directions and it goes and finds the directions for me, gives me the directions and there's my map. I don't know if you can see that on here on this it's not coming out very clearly on the uh, on the camera but you can see there's a map there and if we go back to our screen here and let us just come down and grab the time you can see we've done all of that and it's took a total of 10 minutes to do the whole of that, the whole site with maps and everything.